in this problem, we're being asked to determine if some numbers are rational. That is, can they be written as a fraction? That's what rational means. And we've seen that a repeating decimal, a decimal that goes on forever but has a pattern that repeats, can be written as a fraction. And of course, terminating decimals like this one, 8.816, that can be written as a fraction. This is just 816 thousandths, so that's pretty easy to write as a fraction. Actually, let's say yes to this one already. Uh, and the reason it can be written as a fraction is because this is a terminating decimal. All terminating decimals can be written as a fraction. Now this one has this dot 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 here, so it doesn't terminate. It's not a terminating decimal, but it has a pattern. This 6-4 repeats forever. So this can be written as a fraction because it's a repeating decimal. Now this guy right here, 0.58462, there's a dot dot dot, so it goes on forever. This is not a, re a terminating decimal, and there's nothing there that repeats itself. So this is non-terminating, non-repeating. Those are the decimals that can never be written as fractions. So this one's a no, and the reason is it's neither terminating nor repeating. This last one we have 0.57 repeating. That is a repeating decimal. So it can be written as a fraction because it's repeating. So that is a little bit of work with identifying rational decimals.